Well, the Ministry of Financial Services assembled stakeholders today to evaluate the current forum economic European Union partnership agreement to determine how effectively it has been working for them. Legal advisor and acting director of trade and industry, Kevin Bain, says the Bahamas signed on to the EPA in 2008 with Cariform countries, and presently we have been provisionally applying for the agreement, although it has not yet been ratified. She says the EPA is a reciprocal trade agreement between Cariform, Cariform states or CARICOM member states, the Dominican Republic, and the European Union the stakeholder consultations that are presently taking place this morning is seeking to find out from stakeholders how the agreement is being implemented domestically if there are any issues concerns because at the end of the day member states want to ensure that they are indeed benefiting from the provisions of the agreement and so to get the feedback this morning will be an indication of if there are any issues how best um, can the agreement um, operate to get the full benefits under the agreement Albain well, says the benefit of the agreement is that Cariform states are developing countries and they have to meet less requirements than European Union states that are developed countries. Bain says the meeting also serves to educate more businesses about the agreement. Back in 2008 when the agreement was signed, Bahamian fishermen, lobster fishermen, um, would have urged signing the agreement so that they could benefit and have their products imported into European Union member states um, at a significantly reduced rate in some instances um, duty free. So fish, fishermen that's one example but then um, other companies could take advantage of the agreement uh, once they satisfy the requirements.